ladies and gentlemen, um, anybody want to tell me just what in reading is fundamental is going on here? I've tried to tell y'all, I've warned y'all about misspellings, about the importance of proofreading, and this is right here. You know what I'm saying? Um, this is a funeral program, and uh, usually they on the funeral program, it will name the people who are participating in the funeral, such as the pastor, such as the presiding pastor, such as people who are uh, speaking and making remarks, who are uh, doing the eulogy, and they have flower bearers, and they have pall bearers. Paul start with a P, but instead of Paul bearers, who are the people who are carrying the casket, they got ball bearers. Takes on a whole nother meaning. Takes on a whole nother meaning. Now, usually the Paul bearers do bear balls because for obvious biological reasons. You understand what I'm saying? But that's not something that need to be put on paper. Sometimes we don't need to like we that that what's understood don't need to be explained. You ain't got to say all that. Proofread. I understand. You know what I mean? Just you you can't let you can't do it at a last you, don't let it be the last minute. You know what I mean? I tell families all the time, you know what I mean? Start working on that program because it is the most tedious thing. Let let us let us get started on this right now. It's the most tedious thing because th things like this happen. Now, you can't do a funeral but one time. And people ain't going to die again. They, 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 but now you got ball bearers on here. Now, the, the, the good thing is that at, at a funeral, sometimes it's... It's a good time for a laugh. So, so you got one. You got ball bearers. 